Now this is a video I never thought I'd be making, but it is 2020, so of course it had to happen. Baby cock the Glock and then I let it spray. Today it has been announced that the Toronto Raptors NBA team for the 2021 season will be playing their home games at Amelie Arena in Tampa, Florida, which is the most random place you could have put it, but Nonetheless, I think it's interesting that Tampa finally gets a basketball team. I'm asked from time to time if I watch basketball or if I have a favorite team. And the answer is, I mean, I guess, yeah. This is the only basketball merch I own. It's a Thunder rain jacket. Uh, I bought it two years ago. I've tried to get into basketball before. It's just really hard to win. All it takes to get a championship is one or two superstar players on the same team. It really just comes down to that. Look at the Cavaliers. Championship with LeBron James. LeBron James leaves and they suck at so, you know, for that reason, it's just, it's really hard to watch basketball because it's not like one of those chemistry things where a bunch of good players just play well together and they get to the championship for that reason. No, 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 no. With the NBA, you, you have to have a superstar player. Why do you think the Lakers are so good? LeBron James. So, am I a basketball fan? Not really. No, I've been to one basketball game in my life. It was the Orlando Magic nearly two years ago, and I had fun. For sure, I'd go again, yes. If Tampa's allowing fans to the Toronto Raptors games, fuck it. I might try to go to a couple, just because this is the only time that Tampa's probably ever going to have a basketball team. It's just fun to experience something new, you know what I mean? Currently, basketball is the only sport that Tampa doesn't have. So, it has finally happened. Tampa is a four-sport city <laughs> for a year. I went ahead and I made a logo already for it. The Raptors won the NBA championship last year. So I mean, only appropriate you bring them to Tampa because Tampa has been really successful with sports this year. I mean, let's just look back. The Lightning have won the Stanley Cup. The Rays made it to the World Series. The Buccaneers signed Brady and Gronk, and now they're probably going to make the playoffs for the first time in however many fucking years. And even the minor league Rowdies soccer club made it to the championship game, but it got canceled because of COVID. I probably would have won it, but you know what? Still made it to the championship. So three out of the four current Tampa teams have made it to the championship this year, pending the Buccaneers. Who knows what's going to happen with them, but only appropriate we bring another championship team to the city, as the Raptors, again, have just won it last year. I think it would be cool to put maybe like a small banner, like, <laughs> up in the Amelie Raptors, like, Toronto Raptors 2021 host city or something like that. You know, that'd be cool. Not going to happen, but hey, if you guys have been around with this channel for a while, you know me. I'm very loyal to my three teams, the Chiefs, the Rays, the Lightning. I couldn't, you know, wear other teams' merch, you know what I mean? I say that. I have a St. Louis Blues shirt because family's from Missouri, got to rep up Missouri, and I do have a Kansas City Royals shirt because I was named after a Royals player. So, you know, I have an exception there. But with basketball, you know, I, I wouldn't call myself a loyal fan. You know, I don't I don't watch like any games. The only Thunder game I watched this year was their last playoff game, the one in which they got eliminated. I watched it and I and I didn't even turn it on to like the fourth quarter. When they lost, I was like, okay. I don't really care, you know, it wasn't like, oh damn, this sucks, like it would have been with my other three teams. So, yeah, I mean, people have asked me, am I a basketball fan, do I have a basketball team, and the answer is yes, the Thunder, but am I loyal, am I diehard, god no, not at all, I just, I simply, if they do good, I'm happy for them, if they're, they're not good, then eh, who cares, that's just the way I see it, so... You know, if say there was like a t-shirt that was released that like was the Raptors logo like this one, but it said Tampa, I'd probably buy it just because it's funny. I think the reason they picked Tampa was because they were like kind of running out of time because NBA's training camp starts in like two weeks. So I feel like they were just running out of time and they had to hit the urgency button and just it's like they spun a wheel, it landed on Tampa. They're like, okay, cool, Tampa, we go. One cool thing about this, right, is the only professional sports team in Orlando is the Magic. It's basketball. So the, for the first time in the major sports world of America, we finally have a Tampa Orlando rivalry. And I don't even care that it's basketball. That is still awesome. I've always wanted to like have a sports team in Orlando that wasn't basketball just so there could be like a Tampa Orlando rivalry because it's like an hour and a half drive in between cities. Both cities are awesome as hell. Love them both. But you know, Orlando, it's kind of a small city. It's unlikely, but I'm almost kind of surprised that they didn't try out Kansas City because Kansas City has a really nice 
downtown arena, Sprint Center, which was built for the sole purpose of trying to bring in the Pittsburgh Penguins when they were on the brink of relocation like a decade or two ago. Um, so they, they thought it was going to happen. So they built an arena downtown, brand new, and it never happened. So, you know, they just had this nice arena downtown that they, what, used for concerts? college tournaments so i'm almost surprised they didn't try that one out but anyways that's all i got for this one final thoughts on the the toronto raptors coming to tampa for 2021 it's cool it's really cool i think it's i think it's fun if they allow fans to the games might try to go to a couple just for the experience does that make me a raptors fan no no it doesn't because again i'm just not really big on basketball but it's definitely cool that tampa finally has a basketball team albeit for one season but still it's cool so with that being said i will see you in the next video this is your boy chiefs Ray's bolts peace out